since I was a physical education major in college and I had to take a class in exercise physiology my junior year and I absolutely loved it. I thought it was fascinating to see how the body responded to exercise. I was doing an internship. I was actually working for the New England Patriots because I thought that I was interested in sports administration. Um, and I was living with a family whose son had type 1 diabetes and he and I would go out for a run and then we would come back and he would measure his blood sugar and the two of us would analyze what was happening and it really reinforced what I had just learned in my classes on exercise physiology about how important uh, exercise was in terms of regulating glucose levels and really understanding what is happening in people with type 1 diabetes when they exercise and that really fully convinced me that this is the, the career that I wanted. Really being at the forefront of research on molecular mechanisms of how exercise works, being an important contributor to the overall interest in exercise now as medicine, um, leading some initiatives that the NIH has. I think those have all been really satisfying um, and important parts of my career, but also all the training that I've done. All of us here at Jocelyn, we've trained so many fellows and so many of my former fellows are now professors throughout the world um, and leading their own research careers. That's been really wonderful to see. Some of the research we're doing here um, at Joslin and some of the work in my laboratory is showing that exercise during pregnancy is really important for the health of the offspring. Probably just as important is that if a woman has gestational diabetes, they are at great risk of having uh, developing type 2 diabetes and one of the best things that you can possibly do to prevent that from happening is to stay active keep exercising, even when it's difficult right after you've had, had children, you need to fit it into your schedule. You need to continue to exercise in order to try to prevent the uh, type 2 diabetes from developing as you get older. It's very challenging uh, for women to have any type of demanding career, uh, a research career, uh, other types of career. Um, if you also want to have uh, a family and have multiple children, um, it's very challenging. I have three children myself and I know it's very challenging. So my advice is to make sure that you have uh, support uh, to do it uh, from your spouse, from your workplace. So I think that if you have the desire to do it, you can do it.